a hope for the future. NAR Corporation begins trials of their proprietary recultivation technology. Chromium 90 and plutonium 240. Some never abandoned their homes or even moved back. Will Samichels be removed forcibly from the exclusions of demonstrations across the Ukraine? Ten billions of hernias for an indefinite lease. This is a cabal. NAR thinks they are above the law. What does NAR really hide behind the patent rights? One thing is certain. The sarcophagus must remain intact. Wake up, you sleepyhead. Look, look over there. Do you remember the glade just beyond those trees? That's where you proposed to me. You were so nervous and sweet. You're still sweet, my Professor Kimunik. Anyway, it feels good to return after all these years, doesn't it? Decor? You're still half asleep. Wake up. Awaken. Tanya? Tanya, stop kidding around. You sleepyhead. to me. You were so nervous. And sweet. Tanya, I'm leaving. My professor came in. After all, that's enough.
Why is this place so familiar? It's my old workshop. Please hurry. This reality is coming apart, can't you see? Get back to your work. It's the only way out of here. Feels good to return. The entire zone is on lockdown. Any hour doesn't screw around. Yeah. Let's just hope our source comes through and we don't run into any patrols on the way. And what if we do? We will improvise. That's what our sleeping beauty here paid us for, remember? Sure, sure. Do you really think they'll test this recruit re recultivation something? I haven't seen any signs of that, but I'm telling you, something is up. There are way too many contractors for such a small area. We can handle the contractors. They're probably some of Wagner's rejects. Fuck you. I fought alongside those guys. I know, I'm just messing around, Anton. Let's focus on getting our professor here some of this. Chernobylite? That's what it's called? Igor? Igor. Up, Igor. We have to go. What? I must have dozed off for a moment. Let's go. What are you? Having doubts, Professor? If you're thinking about backing out, you need to tell us now. Not a chance. Let's get this over with. You sure this plan of yours is going to work, Professor Kimenyuk? Igor, please. And yes, it will. You two take care of your part, and I'll take care of mine. All right? Try to keep a low profile. Last thing we want is a firefight. A, a fire? What are you getting us into, Igor? It is necessary. It's something that needs to be done. I don't like riddles, Professor. But you're the boss. It reminds me of that night up in Syria. Misha, we can't! We have to fall back! The pressure's dropping! Downstairs! Now! Go! 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 This is no time for bird watching, Igor. Let's go. Through the fence, into the sewers. Sewers? Oh, and down into the underworld we go. It's nothing but a hole in the ground, Anton. Oh, does anyone else feel itchy? So, how bad is the radiation around here these days? It's been a long time, right? Do yourself a favor and don't think about that right now. Let's focus on doing the job and getting out of here in one piece. Igor, if the shit hits the fan, get yourself out of sight until we take care of it, okay? Don't- Igor, hey, over here! No talking. Go. After you, Igor. Ladies and eggheads first. <laughs> Funny guy, huh? Shit, Igor, get down! Get to the sewer entrance. We're right behind you. False alarm. Must be those fucking rats again. And in the second half of the game as well. Fuck me! Tunnels go to boost again anyway. Quit yapping. That truck didn't drive you on its own. Keep your eyes open and your mouth shut. 
stay in the shadows. Become invisible. So, you were inside the lab? Yeah, for a bit. See anything interesting? Nah. Interesting is above my pay grade. Now pass that bottle, Sergei. Guess it was a mouse. Yeah, must have been rats. I hate goddamn rats. Wonder what the quartermaster made for dinner tonight. Hope it's not more fish. I hate fish. I have to take a leak soon. I'm the tech guy. I'm here about the power outage. This is the place, right? First, let's see some ID, tech guy. He doesn't believe you. No problem. Shit, <laughs> it's gotta be here somewhere. Guys? Look, let's not make this complicated. You forget about the badge and I'll forget about that bottle. No ID, huh? What happened? Leave it in your other purse? He knows. Sorry for the mix-up. We'll let it slide this time, but only this time. Get it? Uh, I should have brought that goddamn power bar. I'm starving. I used to work here, remember? Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> Igor, take a rad reading, will you? Good. Igor. Take a rad reading, will you? 3.6. Not great. Not terrible. Chin up. We're safe for another hour or so, all right? None of you are safe. Captain Olivier, sir. You sure this device of yours works, Igor? I don't have time for getting into details right now, but yes, all it needs is more Chernobylite. Chernobylite, right. The most radioactive compound on Earth. That's what you called it. The man knows what he's doing. Stay the readings are bad. The numbers are too high. We have to get out of here. We can't leave him behind, dear God. Let me out of here. Let me out. Alexander Boresovich, someone has to open the valves manually. Someone has to go inside.
two hostiles up ahead. Quiet, Anton. Left one's yours. I'll take. I'll take the other one, Olivier. Oh, look at Bright Boy over here. Okay, it's your show. But if you get us killed, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> I don't see any leaks. Let's get out of here and report in. Not yet. Get a hold of yourself and keep looking. <laughs> stupid idea. Please don't put us at risk again. I won't. Don't you worry about that. It's been a while. What was that, Eagle? All right, Eagle. You're the star. Ready to execute the plan? I'm... Igor, don't! Tatiana? What are you stalling for, Igor? Time is critical here. It's nothing. I'm just tired. Right. You good? Yeah, I'm good. Please focus on your job and... I focus on mine. Get back to it, then. The reactor room! Now! Nonsense! It was just a fire, nothing more. We'll get it under control. Our BMK reactors do not explode. The reactor core is exposed. I can see the graphite on the ground. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. You killed us, you arrogant son of a bitch. You've killed us all. Let's get this done quickly. Sorry, am I holding you up? Oh, it's even colder than I remember. You've seen one of these before, haven't you? A much smaller fragment, but enough for my initial studies. Are you going to tell me how this fancy gun of yours works? It creates a kind of shortcut through time and space. It's called a wormhole. It forms a tunnel with two mouths. It needs an exotic energy source to keep it open. Exotic energy... Uh, that's the Chernobylite? Exactly. And where does this shortcut lead? It leads wherever it needs to. Let's leave it at that for now, all right? What? My fiance. She disappeared here during the disaster 30 years ago. Yeah, can we talk about her later? Grab the crystals and let's go. Listen, I... Jesus, I'm so sorry, Olivier. Anton was... Uh, he was a good man. Who was that fucker? Hell if I know. Somehow he used the negative energy of the Chernobylite to teleport. 
Now, to confirm this theory... Stop. That doesn't matter right now. Can he get to us here? And where is here exactly? We're inside a wormhole connecting two singularities. It's quite short and not very stable, so we need to move. Do you understand? And no, he can't chase us in here. I, I mean, it's possible in theory, but highly unlikely. I don't want to know. Just get us out of here. This way. You'll come out near Mikhail's place, hopefully. Let's meet there, then. My arm... It feels like the muscle's been twisted from the inside. I'm going to execute that black-masked motherfucker, Anton. I promise you. This place is definitely not what it used to be. It's like a snake, shedding its skin over and over again. You have to learn it all over again. Feel it. Tame it. Singularity, tearing at the fabric of reality. The foundations of this reality are really quite fragile. You're out of time, go! we walk through these gates more than I can count let's go in together my love I need to find a way to reduce my rad levels first look for a little bottle the label will say potassium iodide DTPA and Prussian blue it helps with radiation poisoning where I can see them. What's the password? Would you mind? I can't think with that gun pointed at me. Igor? Oh, damn it. Nostalgia. It's nostalgia. It was your idea, goddammit. You don't look so good, Igor. We don't have any medical supplies, not even bandages. See if you can find something and patch yourself up. Come on in. Igor, you're a bit of a handyman, right? Take a look around and see if any of this crap is useful. This is your element, my sweet. Create order from this chaos.
Tell me you're not going straight back to the power plant. Because if you want to commit suicide, there are easier ways. We're outnumbered, outgunned, out... everything. We need intel, backup, supplies, and most of all, we need a fucking plan. Okay, Olivier, let's hear your plan. I'm glad you're seeing reason. See this board behind me? We can use it to map out our plan of action. Figure out how to get inside the power plant and find whatever it is you're looking for. Or whomever. Every piece of intel, every bit of info about resources, will document in right here. We'll take our next step when the time is right. For today, let's focus on getting our strength back. If we're going to use this warehouse for our base, we need to find some supplies and get organized. Somewhere to sleep would be a start. Maybe we can find some cots? Okay. Let's do this right. Great. I'll do everything I can to help you figure out what happened to this... Tatiana? That was her name, right? One last thing before you go. NAR uses weapons with a biometric lock. We can't use them, so we have to defend ourselves with what we have. Use it as a last resort. I presume you know how to handle firearms? Then you're all set. I have faith in you, Igor. Man, what a view. This panoramic overlook of the zone will help us plan our tasks for the day ahead. Just let me know when you're ready, boss. We can get started. It's time to hit the power plant. We all know it's not going to be easy. We tried before, and not everyone made it. But this time we're smarter and better prepared. I know we can do this. We have to do this. It's the only way we can find Tachana and end NAR. What about that black mask wearing motherfucker? Have you identified him? No, but who cares? When we cross paths, we'll take him out. End of story. This is much bigger than anything any of us has done before. If you want to back out, this is your chance. Igor, you know I always have your back, but this is insane. This mission needs more preparation. I can't support a plan that doesn't have my full confidence. It's your choice if you don't want to help. I can't force you. So it's just me now? Is my plan really that hopeless? I thought it through, and we're not ready yet. We need more time. You can see everything from here. You cannot succeed alone, but there are others who will help you. I'm not sure what to do first. Should I tell Olivier to run some errands, or should I do it myself?
Are we doing this or what? I, Tatiana Amalieva.
I think this approach is working, Igor. Looks like we can sneak in and out of the zone without attracting attention. So, how did it go? Are you any closer to finding your old lady? You still want to go back to the power plant? I have to go back. I have the strongest feeling she's there. Feelings? You surprise me, Professor Kimenyuk. Trusting your instincts is important. But last time we tried that, we lost Anton. We need some hard evidence before we go down that road again. <laughs> Don't worry, Olivier. I'm not crazy. I'll keep gathering evidence, and when I've got enough, we can formulate a new plan. Good. Evidence, plans, information, resources. It will all get us closer to your goal, Igor. How did you do today? I'll brief you in a minute. First, let me point out a couple of things to you. Go on. You need to understand the role you're in. You hired me and rented this warehouse. That makes you the commander of this base. It means you will be in charge of all our equipment and, most importantly, our food rations. You have to start thinking like a strategist, like this is a military operation. Organize the base and take care of your troops. That's number one. Starving is no fun, I know from experience. Forget to feed your troops and their morale will drop. They might even desert you. Also, in situations where resources are scarce, there's a group psychology to consider. Playing favorites, rewarding those who slack off, and not appreciating the men who pull their weight are surefire ways of creating discord amongst the men. What men? There are only two of us. For now, but that has to change if you want your power plant operation to succeed. We need more power, more intel, more skill, and more bodies. And each of those bodies will need space, food, and resources in this base. I know you're eager to bolt out there and continue your search, but you need to be patient, plan, strategize, take it slow. You have to find time to cater to the needs of your companions and manage this warehouse. If you don't, all your plans will be for nothing. You're right. I need to be smart about all of this. Absolutely. And remember, I'm here for you. I will advise and support you every step of the way. That's what you're paying me for.